hey y'all welcome back to my channel so i'm about to go inside kroger's to do a little bit of shopping very 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 little like i ain't getting that much stuff because i already got a lot of stuff uh delivered to the house so i like kroger's because 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 it's a little bit better than shopping at target target is like bougie to me and it's like it's it's nice it's nice it's nice don't get me wrong it's nice but the target by my house um definitely is not having a lot of stuff in there for me to choose from and i don't want to go to whole foods because they're really expensive like what but walmart is like i don't really like shopping at walmart because it'd be empty in there and they don't have variety same thing they don't have variety but kroger's they have a variety of organic and non-organic items that I enjoy eating. And when I first walked inside Kroger's ever in my life, because I've, it, it's, I only made shopping in Kroger for one year. Like, I've never shopped in Kroger. Like, I just started this year. This year. I just started. Okay? So, like, when I first walked in, I was shocked. Like, and I was looking lost as a bitch. Okay? I was like, oh, what? where do I go now? Where do I go now? I'm just walking around looking like I'm about to steal something. But, you know. Nobody was following me around, but they still interrogate you as if you are, okay? But if you're trying to get away from the whole receipt thing like Walmart has, like checking the receipts, come to Kroger's, uh, go to Target, you know? I don't really mind the whole checking the receipt thing because I pay for my shit. I pay for it. It's paid for. But, okay, so this lady literally just pulled up right here while I'm, I, while I'm talking. Why, why is she parked right here? here she people are so nosy okay i moved yes i moved because i don't like people or like the she was looking back and everything like i'm i'm gonna have to point that out in the video anyway yeah going to Roger, kroger's i was very lost but it's okay i like kroger kroger's is cool as a bitch i like kroger's so anyway let me take y'all in there with me Welcome to my Kroger, y'all. It's giving clean store. Ooh. My favorite juice. I love this juice, y'all. I don't know why, but I'm a mother effing fiend. Like, I've been fiending over this already. How many of y'all drink flax milk? Or what kind of milk y'all drink? Comment down below. All right, so I've been trying the whole plant-based thing now. Okay, so it tastes better. It tastes good. I'm vegetarian. I can do that. So these are the things that I've gotten so far. I've been trying these little um, plant-based corn dogs. <laughs> they might be meat. I don't know. But I love me a good flax milk. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm moving the camera all around. I'm so sorry. But I love flax, I love flax milk, okay? Actually, the stuff that's inside of the almond milk, a lot of the almond milks, my kids are actually allergic to. And when I drink the almond milk, I feel a little stuffy, like I'm about to come on with a cold. So I've stopped trying to choose between the different types of almond milks. I've tried several types. My friend did tell me there was another one, but I was like, I'm done trying almond milk. I'm just going to stick with this milk right here because this milk right here this is the milk right here okay this is my favorite milk it might be a little thick on the thicker side but i actually like this milk it's good for something all right and like i told y'all i've been trying all these little plant-based corn dogs they hit they hit now i gotta get me some fruit because i'll be making me some popsicles and me and my kids we be loving them because they be hitting okay straight up i'm about to show y'all see i be making them I be flexing a little bit at home. I do. I do. All right, so boom. My camera phone was messing up right here just a little bit. But, you know, I was looking at the ice cream at the same time and didn't really notice that I was facing the camera down because I seriously was looking at the ice cream. I'm so sorry. But if y'all like this kind of ice cream that y'all see on the screen right now, y'all let me know. eating these cookies for the past few weeks now i've been getting a little weight with these and let me tell you the oreo kind actually tastes like oreo they're supposed to be plant-based yes these two cookies up here i've been getting both of them 
they supposed to be plant-based but they don't taste plant-based not the oreo kind now the cookie chunk it do taste like it's some plant-based shit like it don't got no real taste to it for real but the oreo the knockoff oreo kind supposed to be that shit got like 35 grams of sugar in it like i think that's a little bit obsessive that's probably why it tastes like a regular oreo it don't taste like uh maybe a knockoff like the chocolate chunk but this should be hitting it be hitting though but see, this is why I like shopping in Kroger's because they have a larger variety of natural things in the store. A whole lot of plant. They got a whole lot of plant based stuff at an affordable price that I feel like is affordable price. Three ninety nine. Like you go to Whole Foods and try to get some cookies like this. You know, the box going to be like ten dollars. Nine ninety nine. Like, dang, that's a little bit too much. I'm a mom on a budget and I do want my kids to eat a little healthy. So I do try different things and this is what brought me to Kroger's right here and this is what has landed me and kept me here as a consumer I don't think I want to leave unless I find a different store but if they were more like Walmart and had like clothing and stuff in there then I probably would never leave that store I'm just saying oh I forgot to show y'all that I had got this and this is what I mean by the whole variety thing they got frozen avocados i've never seen this nowhere else anyways y'all it's like 50 days later okay i forgot to record an outro but it's all right though it's all right though i'm here now to do it so that was my kroger shopping spree like i literally did not spend that much i spent like a hundred dollars on a few of those things i bought like a lot of stuff but it won't that much in reality it won't it won't that much stuff and i spent like a hundred dollars um yeah that's my favorite store now <laughs> so anyway that's it for now y'all i will see y'all in the sunday if you like the vid don't forget to hit that subscribe